Hey, how y'all doing today? It's your boy. Dan got the plan back again with another video. All right now, we finna go on and get into my crowd, man. I know y'all been waiting on your boy Dan to come back with the monster. I already know it's two weeks away. We done figure out a whole bunch of stuff. First three picks. In my opinion, it's locked me. I already know what's gonna happen. No introduction on this sort of street. Got your boy Trevor Lawrence going to the Jacksonville Jaguar. I mean, it's nothing but elementary at this point. Everybody know what's gonna go down. Trevor Lawrence, I mean, they already talking about they gonna take him anyway. So yeah, we already know this is number two. What I got right here is Zach Wilson. They got Zach Wilson, they gonna have him come in the, uh, the Jets. They gonna have him bring that, that juice. He's a real exciting player to watch, you know. Number three, we got the San Francisco 49ers. I got them selecting Justin Fields. Justin Fields is one of the best players in this draft. I'm going to be honest. If Trevor Lawrence wouldn't in this draft, he would have went first to the Jacksonville Jaguars. That's all I just got to say. I mean, I know a lot of people want to talk about, oh, man, Ohio State, they don't produce quarterbacks or whatever. But at the end of the day, you stole it out the window, bro. Can that guy be the guy? That's all you need to know. That's all you need to want. And that's what I got in. If this pick does go for Justin Fields, I got the 49ers. Not this year's Super Bowl, but the next year's Super Bowl. That's how, they, that's how they coming, man. Let me see number four. I want to say it's going to be a trade down, but at this point, I'm down. I really, I don't know the Falcons too well. Everybody think they're going to draft Kyle Pitts. Or I don't know. I'm just going to go ahead and keep it like this. We're going to go ahead and just just get them. I mean, just get them. Um, I don't know. <laughs> it's, it's hard for them. They, 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 they just got the trade down. So, I'm going to have... The Denver Broncos coming on. Well, I don't know if they'll be able to make that sound. We're going to have the New England Patriots coming up with the Falcons. And you know they're coming up to select. Is it Mac Jones? <laughs> no, they ain't coming up today. They're coming up. Yeah, they they coming to get Mac Jones. You gonna say the Patriots? Yeah, they coming up to get Mac Jones. They like that guy, man. We got the Bengals. Man, this is educational for Nate Fool. I know a lot of people are going to say, man, they need to get Chase. But nah, you don't need to get that good offensive lineman to protect your quarterback. The Miami Dolphins, we had them taking athletic weapon Kyle Pitts. Nah, I doubt it. I think they're <laughs> they going to go with Chase. I think they're going to go with Chase. I'm just trolling. So. The Detroit Lions, I'm going to say they're going to waddle. I just, I don't know. Detroit is just a hard team to pick for. So, I'm going to say they can go with Smith or waddle. I'm going to say they're taking uh, Smith. And then the Carolina Panthers, we got them taking Kyle Pitts, athletic weapon. I mean, this I got to be concerned. To be honest, some people consider him as the best person to draft. To get him at eight, it's just a steal. Like Carolina, the things are finna move up in there, their place. We got the Denver Broncos, man. They sitting in the clock. They got Trey Lance right here. I'm gonna go ahead and say they take Trey Lance. I mean, what's the use? And we got the Cowboys on the clock right now. Everybody want them to go with Patrick Sertain. But uh, I really don't know. I've just been hearing, <laughs> bro, I've been hearing that people don't want to believe this, but Christian Barmore is going to go higher than a lot of people say. I know a lot of people going to say, but that team, let's go ahead and put them there. They, they, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and say that they're going to take Christian Barmore. They're going to fill up their, uh, what's them called? Okay, so we got the New York Giants on the clock. I'm going to give them Rashad. Slater's back is a little shot. I don't 100% about that. I 
guess I'm just gonna, yeah, they do need Rashad Slater. I'm, I'm giving them Rashad Slater. So, we got, we got the Eagles on the clock right now. So, we got the Eagles taking Jalen Waddle. Seems like an Eagle pick for them. And then at number 13. Oh my goodness, who's number 13? Sorry y'all, for some reason, this man goes on a scroll. Okay, 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 I got the scroll, got the scroll. Let me scroll on down. Okay. I honestly forgot who's at 13. Sorry y'all, I got technical difficulties. Okay, we'll keep it right there for a little. Okay, so we got the Chargers. And the Chargers, I got them going with Christian Darisol. They got to protect their guy. Yeah. No, I'm sorry. It's hard for me to see my mouse. <laughs> yeah, I got, the, got them going with Christian Darisol. Who took the... I would have been in the pages of 15. Okay, so number 14, we got the uh, Minnesota Vikings. I'm just going to go with them taking Orazi. OZs or Orari. Well, you know what? Never mind. They're taking Patrick for Zane since he's on the board right now. Which number 10 and number 14 could be slip flop, but we. I actually really don't know. We want to talk right. We want to know. We got the Falcons. They moved on down. Now they're able to come up here. They can get Aziz. Awari. Pretty good for them. We got the Cardinals on the clock. They're going with JC Horn. They really need a cornerback in that system. And we got the Raiders. The Raiders up here at 17. I don't know if the Raiders can go because it's just so confusing. I'm gonna get them Elijah Vera Tucker because you know that offensive line is looking pretty shabby right now. We got the Dolphins, they're back on the clock. We're gonna give them Michael, I mean, Mikhail Parsons because I'm just saying I, I've been hearing rumors that they really like him and you know. If they can get him and still get that guy Chase up top, man, that is just an uh, amazing draft right there. And then we got number 19, the Washington football team. They got left out of the quarterback market. So we're just going to give them a pick that makes them so much better. I know a lot of people are about to say this won't be that good, but we're going to go ahead and get them a shot, baby. They got scared Terry. They got, oh, bro, let's go ahead and get an offense what they need because next year they're going to try to acquire a quarterback regardless of whatever it takes next year. So we got to go ahead and keep on building that team. They just signed Connor. So, yeah, sounds pretty good for me. I'm going to go ahead and get him with Sean Bateman. I mean, it's not like they <laughs> – it's not like it's going to be a situation where they say, like, no, they can't go this way. But, yeah, they can. Okay, yeah, we got them taking Rashad, baby. Okay, they're taking, we got Chicago on the clock at number 20. Chicago, man, they need, mm, they need offensive line. They need wide receivers. You can get it. They don't need a running back. They invested a lot at the running back position. So, I'm going off the grain here. Let me see who they have on the board at offensive line. They have uh, Sammy Kazi, Telvin Jenkins. I'm going to match them up with Telvin Jenkins. Pretty good guy of Oklahoma State. He plays real nasty. So 
got the coast right here on the clock. I'm just, cause I'm just venturing out right now. I'm gonna say because the coast of my team, I don't really feel like they're gonna pick there. So we're going to have somebody come up. Fuck the Browns. I know a lot of people are going to say, but they just added the Javion Clowney. But I think they're still going to want to come up and add a little more to defensive end. I got them coming up. I know a lot of people are about to be like, what, really? They're going to come up for him with his injury concerns? I got them come up for Jalen Phillips. In my opinion, the number one pass rusher in this draft. And to get him, you have to trade up to get him. But still, you trade up and you get him. In this next pick right here, I got, got Tennessee going with Caleb Farley. They, 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 they get a steal. I don't, know, I, don't, I don't even like Tennessee. And yeah, they sit up here and they get Caleb Farley. Yeah, it's late. Cause I don't, we don't know. There might have been no one on that board the whole time. We got the uh, Jets come back on the clock. They want an edge rusher. I'm thinking they looking at someone like Jail. Jail Way. I'm pretty. I know a lot of people gonna say, well, he just added this guy. They just, you know, they just got the guy from the Bengals. But I'm gonna be honest, just because they got him from the Bengals don't mean nothing. I think they want to take another athlete at that spot. They did Jason always, you know, really strengthen it up, strengthen that defense up, bro. Because always would be a perfect guy to pair with Carl Lawson. Then we got the Steelers on the clock. This might not be, a lot of people probably not going to consider this as being a sexy pick, but we're going to go with uh, Creed Humphreys because they did just have, I, I know a lot of people want to say, oh, it's not that big of a deal, they, uh, what's it called? but they they got just retired, Pouncey just retired, so they really going to need another guy there. We got the Jacksonville Jaguars, they're back on the clock. Man, they can pretty much just go wherever. I'm thinking they're going to go ahead. They're going to give your boy Trevor Lawrence a welcome. They give him a weapon. They give him Davis Tony from Florida. <laughs> now we got the coach sitting on the clock at 26. Since they moved down with the Browns. Yeah, since the Browns moved up. We got Sammy Cosme here. But we want to take another guy. A lot of people will be like, why? Why? But we got them going with Quiddy Pay. Come on, man. Y'all don't know where I was going to go. 27. Got the Ravens on the clock. I know they looking at a wide receiver. They was, they was pretty thirsty for a wide receiver. So we're going to go ahead and give them Terrence Marshall Jr. They really don't have a receiver like him. One of those bigger guys that can uh, make plays. They only, they, well, I don't know. They really just like speed rushes. We got the New the Saints on the clock. I would really love for the New Orleans Saints to get Daniel Jones, but Daniel Jones not on clock. The Patriots traded up for him. And so, we can look at a weapon. We can look at safety. Let's go right here. Let's look at the cornerbacks because people know this, but eventually, they don't know just yet, but he might not be there. I'm talking about Marshawn Lattimore. And he is a player for them on that defensive end. 
So, I'm going to give them a guy like Asante Samuel Jr. A good, nice corner, you know, just to keep on adding up. We got the Green Bay Packers on the clock. I got them going with a wide receiver. I got them going with Elijah Moore. Oh, Rondell. Nah, I got them going with Rondell Moore. Playmaker in that offense for Aaron Rodgers. Is he finally going to get a playmaker? Then we got the Bills selecting Carlos Basham Jr. Boogie Basham, as they call him. We got the Chiefs at 31. I don't know <laughs> where I'm going with the Chiefs right now, man. Because the Chiefs, they're like that team that, man, you can pick anything for them. I believe this guy is still there. I'm going to go J O K. <laughs> joke. Go joke. I can't believe he's still on the clock. Then we got the Bucks. Man, the Bucks, they can go a lot of different ways. I'm going to have the Bucks. Man, cornerback. Gonna have them taking Trey Morig and for everybody to say like man, they just won't have to run in that wood. Bucks. You get to pretty much just pick whoever you want at this point, because I mean they practically don't have any holes, so I mean. Alright then y'all make sure y'all like, subscribe, turn on post notifications. It's been your boy Dan. What am I draft? Let's get it.